Hi Gemini, I hope you're doing well. So we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about here for the rest of the year. Friendship here. This person's wanting to date you if it's a newer person. But regardless, if it's someone from your past, this is also a card of reunion. But they're bringing a friendship your way. Page of Pentacles. It's a slow moving energy as well with the tower in reverse. Knight of Wands. Ooh, okay, a warning, especially if you're dealing with a water sign. It's almost someone who's coming to you with an empty cup. So there is an energy of wanting to come back around, but it's more so because you're filling some sort of void. This person can be codependent when it comes to you. Few of you can have some drinking issues, but they're unstable and they're wanting to come together with you. It can be a Scorpio death in reverse, but just the energy of someone having a hard time letting go and releasing. Let's do some clarifying here. Why is Three of Cups? Yeah, see, reconciling Five of Pentacles in reverse. Someone wants to come together. Few of you are, well, majority of you, if it's resonating. This is your energy, I feel. Seven of Cups, Queen of Wands, the Star, Eight of Cups, someone knowing their worth and going after their dreams here. This person may have been keeping you stuck, holding you back in some way, but you're wanting to experience more. Very confident energy in someone who knows that they have other possibilities. I feel like some of you are keeping your options open. You may feel this is unrequited. I'll get your feelings in a second. Why is Tower in reverse? If someone is avoiding you, they're still interested in keeping an eye on you. But again, I don't get the most stable energy. Why is Knight of Wands? Knight of Wands in reverse. I'm curious to see if they're taking action towards you. They're wanting to. Yeah, some of you feel like there's no future here. You don't see this going anywhere. Because you know the truth, especially if this person was lying, cheating, or just wishy-washy, right? Knight of Wands in reverse. Eight of Wands in reverse. I don't see progression here. Even if, see, how I started out the reading is this person was wanting to come together, but only as friends. Someone here is also resistant to change. That is why things aren't moving forward. Fear of change. How will Gemini be feeling? So if it is a newer energy, I do feel like this person is moving very slowly here. How will Gemini be feeling? Some of you are friend zoning this person. And keeping, yeah, I keep getting that. Especially some of you, this you may have felt this was sex based, some like a fling, more passionate, and you're getting attention from others, six of wands, six of swords. I keep getting a moving forward energy with you, whereas this person sort of standing in one position. You may be thinking, okay, you know, I'll get to know them as a friend and I'm not putting all my eggs in one basket because I don't really, you know, see this person. I feel like they're not taking much action. What action is this person taking towards Gemini?
They're looking over at you. This may be someone that is always busy. They have a lot going on with their work. So they may not be giving you all the time, attention. You've That is coming through. But it's someone who's really concerned about their money, finances. That is their focus. But again, Page of Swords, they're looking at you, King of Pentacles, heads turned, looking in your direction. Interesting how that came. See, I feel I felt like the stuck energy with this person. And we have Hanging Man. If they're stuck in another connection, that is really coming through here. But then they're not doing anything to free themselves of that situation if they're unhappy. They seem to be chained here, stuck. Sometimes King of Pentacles is a stubborn energy, especially in reverse. So again, I'm getting that message here. Um, someone not wanting to make changes, resistant to change. What is this person's intentions towards Gemini? What is this person's intentions? person is again holding back from you secretly unhappy really is what is going on I don't think this person has direction when it comes to you uh, friendship here on both ends I see it in your feelings I see it perhaps you're saying you know I see you going through some difficult times so I'm giving you space I do see that energy here as well clarify moon in reverse for Gemini's feelings actually should have clarified the nine of pentacles mm, same no direction three of wands in reverse four of pentacles holding back giving very little of yourself, which is the best correct approach if this person's not opening up, right? Because they have some inner work to do. Let's get you some oracles. Someone focused on their work, wanting to come together with you, keeping their eye on you, not wanting to move forward, but also not wanting to let you go. much to make it work tired of putting in the effort okay so that resistance to change I was getting we also have you want things your way you're very <laughs> powerful with that queen of wands and you know how you want things I can definitely see that and we have they fear losing their freedom apologize for the sounds they're in a cycle of lust. We also have 42 coming through, focused on physical attraction. So that is something coming through, um, that they are very physically attracted to you. We also have right person, wrong time, and painful memories, the past affecting the present. One more. They idolize you, 31. Your presence is intimidating. I feel like you're their physical ideal here with this combination. Let's get this deck and then we'll get you advice. Wow, we had right person, wrong timing, right, with this deck. And look, first card to flip through. Timing has been important. I want to be with you, but 
but it's just bad timing. Perhaps we're just star-crossed lovers. Interesting. Yeah, something about timing, Gemini, and then this person wanting to slow things down. I feel you're okay with it. So if you are wanting to make this work, it will be. It's like moving at a turtle's pace. We have this is not a good time to push hard for answers. You may not like the outcome. Wait for it to come to you. This jealousy is making me want to rush in. Yeah, they know you're attractive. Queen of Wands is one of the more physically attractive out of the four queens. Just the energy you embody, your aura. There's a you know, natural magnetism. It has to do with your confidence and the way you carry yourself. Yeah, this jealousy is making me want to rush in. Don't be surprised if I get a little too overprotective. I want you to myself. This can be. Especially if you're dealing with someone with Scorpio placements. Yeah. One more. Accept my romantic gesture. I want to experience something meaningful with you. Oh, okay, someone may be coming out of another long-term commitment. I'm ending my current relationship to be with you. Kids come first. I need to do things right. Please be patient with me. I do love you. So this person's planning on making some sort of gesture towards you. I wasn't getting solid action. I was getting someone who's stuck and really focused on their finances. Oh yeah, Queen of Cups, Four of Swords in reverse. I'll be back around for sure. Expressing emotion. What advice do you have here for Gemini? Give yourself some extra love and attention. Treat yourself to a facial, a rose bath, or anything that helps you feel and see your own beauty. Your attention from others as well. It's like the spotlight is on you. That's what I'm getting. Special event. This rarely comes through, I've noticed. Yeah, look, she's embracing herself. Self-love coming through. We have special event. Again, the Queen of Wands was in the red dress and similar red dress here. Fate will play a role in your love life. Pay attention to the people who come into your life unexpectedly. Stay curious and keep exploring. Yeah, you'll be getting a love offer. Some of you literally can be at an event, right? Some special occasion. That's like someone who's getting ready for a celebration. I love this reading for you, regardless of what is going on externally to you with this person. There are some challenges I see for them, but you, you're doing very well. It's a lot of energy to get things done. You're feeling very confident. It's amazing. Gemini. Divine timing, what's with timing? Something about timing. Have patience as nothing can occur until the conditions are completely ready. Trust in divine timing. And we also had fate will play a role in your love life. It's almost like you don't have control. So that's a message. Go with the flow, let go. You're being guided, you're being protected. You're being led in the... Ooh. Wow. Look. We have commitment, so we have the rings. Celebrate is this engagement party. Soulmate winter. They're giving you timing. Some of you may have gotten engaged in the winter, or you may be meeting someone. We're in winter right now, depending on where you're at, but it can be by next year. There will be celebration and 
a solid commitment headed your way. This is beautiful. Wow. It's like telling a story and there's divine timing at play, but winter pl will play a significant role here. What you desire will manifest in the winter months, also a time of solitude, survival, and quiet reflection. I think I'll leave you there, Gemini. Take care of yourself, and I will see you soon. Bye.